What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Pablo Play with CJ. Today we're focusing on Pablo Dotsuk signing a three-year extension worth $22.5 million to remain a Detroit Red Wing. It runs through the 2017 season, so we'll likely end his career uh, with the Wings. Um, he's actually going to be 35 in July, really creeping up there in age. The former uh, seventh-round draft pick from the actually sixth-round pick from the, the '98 draft. Um, he was 10th in the league in scoring this year with 49 points in 47 games. Still one of the preeminent two-way players in the game. Was plus 21, which is also in the top 10. Eighth in assists. Um, you know, really, you can talk about stats all day, but, you know, a player like that is way more than stats. You know, you look at the two-way presence he brings to the game. Excuse me, on night and night up basis, and that's what you get from Dotson. That's what he makes his money on. That's what's, you know, probably going to make him a Hall of Fame player. I mean, you look at the numbers. Right around a point of game, 767 points in 779 games as I started like an idiot. He's, I think, was a plus 229 in his career. Uh, he's been a minus player once, and that was in 2003-2004. Um, you know, penalty minutes, 200 penalty minutes career, so Lady Bing, finals pretty. I think he's won it at least once. And, uh, you know, a guy like him is way more than stats. I love the term on this because he's, um, you know, he, like I said, he's getting up there in age. So, you know, keep him around 38. The, the cap hits a little heavy, but then this is a guy that still had you know, like I said, better than a point a game this season, so you really can't complain about that. Um, and, you know, that, that's what you're going to get. I mean, I, I think it was a good move by the Illich just to ensure he ends his career in Motown. Um, and, you know, he's, I, I, I tweeted this today, and I didn't get enough responses. So I was kind of disappointed and disheartened. But um, I'd put him on Paul Sergei Fedorov career-wise. I mean, I think he's a Hall of Famer. I mean, the, the numbers don't necessarily jump off the page. I mean, you look at the fact he's won two Stanley Cups, won a couple Selkies. Um, and, you know, just been a great player. I mean, he's one of the best two-way players of the last, I don't know, what, decade? I mean, I mean to say an all-time great two-way player is really, you know, high praise. But, I mean, hey, you know, his, his resume speaks for itself. And that's that's a Detroit Red Wing way. You don't hear a lot of Pavel Dutz. So you don't hear him going out there hanging out with Russian models and, you know, going out and partying like a rock star, like certain Russian superstars who shall remain nameless that play on nation's capital. But... You know, he does it, you know, the right way. And, you know, if you want to watch him, him and Patrice Bergeron are the two, I think, classiest players in the game. I think they play the game right. They play 200-foot games. And that's what, you know, that's the way it's supposed to be done. That's the way it's supposed to be done. And um, that's what they do. Anyway, bottom line, good move for the Wings. I know they're going to get knocked for signing a 35-year-old, a soon-to-be 35-year-old to a three-year extension. But, actually, yeah, it'll run out when he's 38. He'll be going on 39. But um, I think it's a good move. You know, you can't let a guy like this away. You know, he's one of the... He's probably in the top ten all time in Detroit. Most franchises being in the top five. But, you know, Detroit's... Um, when you get guys like Lidstrom, Eiserman, going back I'm going back chronological order. Uh, you know, Fedorov, like I said. That guy, Gordy Howe, he was, he was okay. You know, uh, Del Vecchio, t- terrible Ted Lindsay. You know, so he's probably... Six or seven, I'd probably do a piece later. Top ten Red Wings of all time, but he's probably six or seven all time in the history of Detroit Red Wings, which is high praise for a guy that won the sixth round. Anyway, that's all this episode of the Power Play with CJ on Pavel Dotsuk signing a three-year extension. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the finals and beyond. Later, guys.